All right, so here we'll learn about how to find the largest product of two numbers with a word problem in area and perimeter. So Granny builds a rectangular fence with the perimeter of 20 centimeters or 20 meters around the farm. So we have, uh, we're gonna figure out what is the largest possible area of the fence. So L and W, let's say L is the length with this W and we know that the perimeter is 20. So that means L plus W, so, sorry, this is W, this is L. So L plus W plus L plus W is equal to 20. So L plus W plus L plus W is equal to 20. So that means L plus W is equal to 10. But this actually isn't enough information because, well, L can be one and W can be nine and L can be two and W can be eight. So we wanna figure out what the largest possible area can be. And to do that, Well, it turns out that you might intuitively figure out that, um, here for example, if L could be one, sorry, L could be nine and W can be one. So if it's nine and one, then you get an area of 10. Um, if it's eight and two, you get an area of 16. So you actually get a bigger area. Basically, um, the reason for that is because you barely decrease this dimension at all, but you double this dimension. So that's why you get a bigger area. Similarly, if you, seven times three is 21, so it's actually bigger, even though it's the same perimeter. Six times four is also bigger, it's 24. And then five times five is uh, the biggest. Um, now, once you get bigger uh, width than five, then you just kind of flip the length and the width, right? So you just kind of like rotate this triangle or this rectangle over a little bit. So that actually doesn't, you get 24 and then three times seven is back to 21. So same here and same here. So um, the maximum therefore is when the two sides are as close together as possible. Five times five is 25. So whenever you have two numbers which add up to something and you wanna find the maximum product of these two numbers, the way to do that is try to make these two numbers as close to each other as possible. That always, almost, almost always gives you the uh, largest possible product.